Hey everyone, my name is Brian Wilson and I'm the creator of The Forest Cathedral, a first-person environmental thriller set on a remote island. Playing as scientist Rachel Carson, players will slowly uncover the effects of a pesticide by using advanced environmental technology to solve 2D and 3D connected puzzles. Accessibility is a core pillar here at Whitethorn Games, and today I want to highlight all the accessibility features The Forest Cathedral has to offer. 2D platforming is at the heart of the game, but a series of precise jumps and dashes aren't for everyone. So we worked hard on a few options that will help players progress. Deadly spikes are filtered throughout the 2D world, making the platforming even more challenging. If that's not your thing, you have the ability to turn the spikes off for a certain section that's tripping you up, or the whole game, whatever you want. Float mode was created for players with limited mobility or anyone who has difficulty with precise timing or reaction times in general. By reducing the little man's fall speed, players are given a greater amount of time to react or correct mistakes before dying. Little man, are you okay? The bugs can be dangerous. Between the no spikes and float mode, you can use one, the other, or whatever combination that suits your playstyle. Open Dyslexic is a typeface designed against some common symptoms of dyslexia. The typeface can be turned on at any time for UI, subtitles, and menu text. Those are just some of the accessibility options. The game will also include the ability to turn off flashing static when the little man dies, adjust game volume and look sensitivity, invert the y-axis, and rebind both controller and keyboard inputs for most actions. I worked with my programmer Phoebe Shalloway and Whitethorn's very own accessibility specialist Britt Dye to bring these options to life. The Forest Cathedral will be coming to PC and Xbox in early 2023, but you can stay updated with the game by wishlisting it on Steam and following me on Twitter, at BlanketsWilson.